New tonight at 11, a multi-million dollar deal between the city of Jacksonville and with the Jags on Lot J is said to be close to an agreement. On your side's Nick Perot was also on this story tonight and explains when the development could break ground. Been here now for about two weeks that they're close to to final deal. Close is all he could get from Mayor Lenny Curry in his administration's talks with the Jacksonville Jaguars and the development of Lot J. I believe this will dr drive development all down Bay Street. The mayor announced in July terms were reached to create an entertainment center, hotel, office space, and apartments in place of the current 1,400 parking spaces. In July, the investment neared 450 million. Now estimates closer to 700 million according to our partners at the Florida Times Union. The mayor did not say when we might actually see shovels in the ground. I mean, I know the expectation is to uh, be able to break ground sometime in the spring, which means uh, we need a bill to put in city council, so uh, they need to move fast. The city is still expecting to put money behind the deal. Estimates in July put the number in the ballpark of $230 million. Where the money is coming from and if those incentives will increase is still unclear. When we uh, present our term sheet to City Council, that'll all be laid out. Uh, it'll be premature to say that because, again, as they hammer out the final details, something could change between now and what I've heard because it's not final yet. Talks for more than a year that a deal had been reached, but yet to see anything but air that could change come springtime. Nick Perot, First Coast News, on your side.